This is a traditional Junju uh, bibimbap, which says a lot because who, who knows, your girl might end up living in Junju. Um, it's the place that we went to where it had the triple pie. So this is my, as of right now, oh, and this is like kirang chim. So it's just like, it's almost like a, an egg souffle. Look at it, it's still cooking. We love it. Wow, what a time. What a time it's been. Finally heading on out after 21 days. I have so many things that I could say um, about my time here in Korea. It was a beautiful challenge for sure. And um, I miss Korea a lot. Um, some things stayed the same, some things never changed, some things really changed um, for the good and for the bad, depending on your perspective. But overall, just amazing healthcare, that's for sure. Um, amazing, delicious food, amazing culture, amazing history, amazing preservation of history. Um, I think the biggest thing that I learned while being here would definitely have to be um, the message that um, I got in Kyungju with my homie, um, Sukyong. I believe her name was Sukyong, yeah. Um, uh, she was 65, had two, has two kids, and um, is one of the caretakers of the traditional um, uh, Hanok um, a home that was for the general and that got passed down um, to the throughout the family um, and the family you know takes care of it um, the Chong Chong Bunis, the yeah I believe that's the name like headmasters grandmasters um, but uh, yeah she basically told me um, I think when we were talking I said something about like you know life you know so something is hard I was talking about something is hard and then she just looked at me and then she said she said, um, mm. um, in Korean, in uh, which basically she said, life is happiness and difficult things walking on the same street. They walk together. Like that is life. And I think I'm going like I literally started crying when she said that and um and I know she really said that for me and um I just want to tell her thank you because I think the process of coming on this trip um leaving my biggest contract at work um preparing to come here um going through all the health um things spending time with friends tr tr group traveling after such a long time um it was definitely happiness and, and difficult, like happening at the same time and learning to be very neutral about everything in life, but in being very present so I can enjoy every single thing. Like when I'm in pain, being grateful because I can feel the pain and I can ask for help. Um, knowing when I'm like happy and sitting with that and then sharing that with others, you know? Um, so yes, I did not document um, or nor am I sharing like, many of the lows that I had on this trip because I think the biggest thing that um, I want to remember is that while watching these videos later on in life for myself is to see that I chose joy the best way that I could every single day while I was here. Um, I checked myself when I was not like interacting with the people who I loved in a way that I know I would be proud of later on. Um, so yeah, I think it's one of the things I just love about traveling. It really humbles you. And that's one of the things I also love about, you know, making sure I stay in touch with the people I love because they ground you and they drag you to your excellence. So um, that is all for the trip, y'all. I'm about to head on out. Um, stay tuned. Um, and yeah, just remember to cultivate your joy. I'm about to eat.